Hey guys, this is Jeremy. Um, I just want to do kind of a retouch up on my last week's video. Um, as you guys who have been following me for a little bit um, saw my last week's video was about Scooter's new home. And I thought that video turned out pretty good. Um, and it's been doing pretty good on views on YouTube. But as I've rewatched it, trying to get an idea of what I could improve on, I realized I left out a lot of stuff. Um, I didn't even show you guys how this drawer works. And so, I want to first show you guys. There's Scooter. I've rearranged his cage just a little bit. Over here, I have his new tunnel. There's a tunnel over there. Um, he likes to dig holes in these corners. Really loves that. So he really doesn't use the tunnel too much. Same with that one. Okay. There's a salad, water, and heat mat. So one thing I didn't go over is where I hit the light. Hit the light in this top spot right here. Um, because from a front angle, you don't see a light bulb. And it leaves a nice shadow on our back wall, which is kind of fun. Uh, the summer kind of looks like it's sizzling with the shadow effect. So, let me move Scooter out of the way. Um, so that way he's safe when the drawer is closing. That is the biggest thing with this cage is keeping him safe. And with one hand, I can close it. And it is closed. Anyways, guys, I just want to really show you um, that pretty cool effect. That the ground actually does expand in his habitat, which is pretty awesome. So, Scooter seems to be doing very healthy. He's eating a healthy portion of salad every single day, which is awesome. This month, I'm planning on doing a couple of different videos. Um, one video I'm do planning on doing in particular is my tor or turtle video. Um, I moved them out of their 30 gallon tank into a 100 gallon aquaponic system. They seem to be loving it. It's huge, they have a huge land area, and they don't come out of the, out of the water very often. Like I said, it's aquaponics, so it uses the plants to filter all of the um, waste out of the water and it seems to be working really well. The plants are growing and I can't wait to show you the video. Dad planted them and they are growing really well and so that will be fun to check out. Um, I am also planning on doing a reptile room update. I'm probably going to be towards the end of the month. Uh, just how everybody's looking. I think end of the month they will be ready to be all on the same video. So I just wanted to um, invite you guys to keep following me on this channel. It's been great um, communicating with you guys and keeping in touch with you. Um, right here I have my bearded dragon, Sheldon, who's such a big boy. I've had him for about, oh, probably about eight months now. and He is awesome. He's very big and very friendly. Um, I've switched over from using mainly Facebook to communicate with to Instagram and Twitter. Um, I've been feeling that my videos on Facebook haven't been being followed very well. Um, I feel like Facebook has kind of, because of different algorithms, they kind of block my videos. Um, and want me to upload content directly to Facebook. And I don't want to do that. I want to keep focusing on YouTube and um, because that's where people go for these type of videos. So they will still be on YouTube. Um, you can follow me on Instagram and um, Twitter and that's where I will be announcing my new videos and you know, just communicating with you guys. I'll be taking pictures of these awesome um, guys and 
bunch of other fun things that I've, I come across. If you guys are interested, I have another YouTube channel with my wife. Um, we do kind of a vlog um, channel where we just kind of go about our days. There's a lot of maintenance on these guys' cages, so if you want to check out some of them, you will see the maintenance on them. So like and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. 